And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It is Bayern Munich facing Salzburg. Thanks, Derek. Well, the hosts are clear favourites going into this tie. But with that comes pressure, particularly against a team that will remain compact, are well-drilled defensively and are a threat on the counter-attack. If the hosts don't go through, though, it will be a major upset. for Bayern. Sven Ulreich starts in goal. Niklas Zule starts with Dayo Upamecano in central defence. Leroy Zane plays with Serge Gnabry on the flanks. As for the attackers, Robert Lewandowski starts alongside Thomas Müller. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, they play with the diamond in midfield, which makes the role of the holding midfield player so important. Is he there to dictate the play with his passing or be a defensive screen? I'd hope he could do both jobs. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage, match day one, underway. Lewandowski. And dispossessed. A promising move this from Bayern. But nothing comes of it. Oh, that pass easy on the eye. Fantastic reflex action. Based on recent form, Stuart, you can make a strong case for Robert Lewandowski to have a big say in the proceedings today. Well, the best players can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas, in and around the box. His creativity is excellent. Playing little one-twos, balls round the corner, linking up with other teammates, just to have that little bit of penetration. He's going to be key to breaking down this defence. bit sloppy in possession good work to win the ball back high up the pitch threaded through by Müller oh wonderful save well he reacts so quickly there that's a great save Kick played in. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. And here's Joshua Kimmich. Baba. This is Muda. Gnabry. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Only one possession back. What can they do from here? Had a hit them, not quite accurate enough though.
Karim Adeyemi. Antoine Bernel. Good use of the ball, but can they trouble the defence? Well, we can take another look at how close this was. It was marginally over the line, yes, but no doubt it was a goal. Well, Bayern restart the game, and that should certainly shake them up a bit. throw in it's going to be this looks promising and a really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened this might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Joshua Kimmich. This is Robert Lewandowski. Sané. Now showing excellent judgment to intercept. gone up and there wasn't much in that Kimi this is Müller things great defending player on the way again well they get the ball once more well there it is the away side haven't had as much of the ball but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back i expect more of the same i think it's been a really good performance from them so far But hang on, the flag has gone up, and it's not going to count. Well, it was a close call, but he is just offside. Good finish, mind you. Serge Gnabry. And unable to keep the ball. Now he must favour the cross. Karim Adeyemi. Oh, a vital interception. Lewandowski. Sané. Danger averted. Given away by Lewandowski. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. And it's Müller finding forward gears. Delivering it into the box. Ah, goalkeeper's ball. Not the best of crosses, really, was it? Lewandowski. Müller. 
takes aim. Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Take it away. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Coleman. Brilliantly blocked. Just wanted to get it out of there. So the whistle then. We're at the halfway stage in this match. Well, Robert Lewandowski hasn't quite influenced the game in the manner we thought he might, Stuart. Well, Derek, he's usually so clever around the edge of the box, but today he just hasn't shown that. As the touch map shows us, he hasn't had enough touches in those key areas. And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. And a strong tackle. What's he going to do here? Muda. And space for him to cut in. Well, the keep. In it goes! At the second time of asking. And the keeper feels hung out to dry. Well, let's take another look at this. And from the attacking point of view, everything's right. The shot across the goalkeeper, players coming in for the rebound, and there's not much the goalkeeper could do about that. He made a good effort on the first one, couldn't react to the second. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. Christensen. Patient enough build up. Can they carve out a chance? Really important piece of last ditch defending. Müller. And they'll get ready for the throw in. Can he play it in? And caught with ease, no real threat from the cross. I well, couldn't find a teammate, unfortunately. And a throw-in to come. And a substitution in the offing. Sunny. Has someone to play it to. Real chance. Well, he couldn't quite keep it on target. Just wide. Karim Adeyemi. Oh, that pass easy on the eye. This looks promising. Well, what a stop that was. 30 minutes to go then. On the offensive. Gnabry! And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Well, they haven't created too much lately, but the fans know this is a chance to take the lead here.
keen to take it short here Robert Lewandowski in the middle not fantastic defending let's see if it helps the opposition got to keep the ball a bit better than that can they hit on the break now oh, doesn't get away with it free kick given there has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes and now both sides will make personnel switches Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? 20 minutes remaining. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Ignaz van der Brent. This could level it. Oh, he's missed it. He'll be kicking himself. Well, the opportunity presented itself and they really should be level. They have to be more composed, more clinical if they want to get back into this. Unable to keep the ball. Zula. Top class defending. Possibilities inside the box. And possibilities here. And into the clutches of the goalkeeper. Well, with the final whistle fast approaching, the big question is, can Bayern see this out? They're almost there, Stuart. Well, for much of this match, they've controlled the tempo of the game and deserved their lead. But this is going to be a frantic finale. They just need to defend their box really well here. And Kimi couldn't keep it. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? This could be the equaliser. But no, when your goalkeeper comes up with a save like that late in the game, you have cause to be thankful. Well, that could be a key moment. They have to take those sort of chances. They won't get too many more, but let's credit the goalkeeper. Niklas Zule. Sané has it. Coman. And the pass could do damage. And the attack carried promise, but petered out. Relentless high pressing. And that is going to be a free kick.
lovely ball. A master of keeping his composure. It's gone in! And well, he might celebrate on the back of that. Well, you have to ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed, but he still had to finish it, and he did it really well. It's a good goal. is 3-1 the current scoreline here from the Brent textbook defending inside the box so full time it is and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign yeah, that's a good win and a vital three points. Another win next time out and they'll be in a great position. What a good performance it was from Robert Lewandowski. Not that that should come as any great surprise. Well, he should be happy with his goal and the win, but he'd be slightly annoyed that he hasn't scored a couple more. Overall, though, I thought he was excellent.